Hey everybody, welcome back to Reviews with Fay Renee. Today, we're going to review that brand new film, Breaking. Produced and directed by Abby Damaris Corbin and co-written by Kawami Kui Ama. So let's do it. Break it. Break it. <laughs> okay now, so you all, I'm just going to put some stuff right out front on here. Breaking was one of the most powerful movies of the year as far as story and performance, mainly the performance of the lead character, John Boyega. I mean, it was winning. It was like on par with Denzel Washington. This man's talent is off the chain. <laughs> it would be another British actor, you know. <laughs> they got beaten the hell out of us. But anyway, now, you only need a quick short plot scenario here uh, with slight spoilers about breaking. So here we go. Breaking takes place back in 2017, and it's based entirely on the true story of ex-Marine veteran Brian Brown Easley. Brian returns home to the States after serving and runs into serious financial problems. He is having quite the difficult time getting on his feet and trying to specifically receive on time his disability check a payment that he sorely needs right now from the VA. Now, all of the details of how this happened to him is meshed out really well in the film um, by Brian's actions. John Boyega's performance as this guy, Brian Easley, it just like bleeds through your soul. And it is a very, very tragic and familiar tale of veterans who return home and they never seem to get the right help financially and most importantly, I think in this case, mentally. So Brian becomes desperate and makes a really bad fucking decision. I'm sorry, y'all. He hopes this decision will gain attention from the media, a venue to tell broadly to the world his story and represent, so to speak, how hard it is for someone like him and other vets dealing with the VA, social security, and all that damn red tape, all of the holdbacks that many of them face when they are trying to reassimilate themselves with society. So at uh, Brian's lowest point, he decides to rob a bank and he holds two female bank officers as hostages whom, by the way, was portrayed beautifully by Nicole Bihari as bank manager Estelle Valerie and Salinas Lava as bank teller Rosa Diaz, and threatening everyone with a homemade bomb. Unless he gets the attention he desires to address his problems to the world, including that damn $892 disability check. That's what he wants. He doesn't want the bank's money. He wants what's owed him. And you guessed it, this all goes really, really bad for him. Everyone in the movie theater knew that, including Brian. Everybody knew it, how this would end. But the story had to be told. And kudos to the producers of Breaking that did not hold back. Yes, Breaking is a tragic tale. And it made me so angry. And sad because this situation is far too familiar and it's true. <sighs> I digress. Woo! Final thoughts, final thoughts. I thought the director, Abi Damaris Corbin, that's a tongue twister, he did a fantastic job in breaking. And I thought the writing was perfect. Now, I also think this is a very much Oscar worthy film, especially the acting part for John Boyega. I can see him being at least nominated for best actor in a drama. But we'll see how that goes. Lots more films and acting to come. So everybody's gonna be vying for that top prize. <laughs> Breaking is a must see film. I give Breaking a 4.75 stars out of five. That is definitely Oscar material. And you know what? I wouldn't take kids to see it. I'm just saying, but you know what? Do your thing like y'all always do. Breaking is very real and very intense. 
And you know what? Finally, finally, my birthday is over. Jesus, thank God. <laughs> and all I wanted was subscribers for my birthday. And I did get quite a few. Thank you guys so much. I love you. And I still need subscribers all the time. So if you have not subscribed to my channel, what are you waiting for? <laughs> Please hit that red subscribe button below once. Check the little bell once. And you'll be reminded only once the next time I drop a powerful Super califragilistic, <laughs> unconventional, crazy review from Reviews with Faye Renee. And of course, subscribing is 100% free as always. And finally, finally, we are always streaming on the new Infinity TV app for Roku. Just download the app, check the broadcasting schedule for Reviews with Faye Renee, and start watching. You can also check our social below to find us on IG, Facebook, YouTube, as you're looking at now probably. And always lots of wonderful things on our website, www.reviewswithfayrenee.com. And please remember guys, like the video, give me a thumbs up, leave me a comment. So I'll see you guys all next week with a brand new hot video drop. And that's it. That's all. This is Faye Renee. Holla! Feel the blood creeping up from the heathens Got will, got fight, got pride, got reason If they wanna go eat, then you know I'm gon' feed them If you're coming for me, hope you're ready for a demon I got eyes in the back of my head I'm seeing Take me for granted and you know I'm leaving I'ma take what's mine with the webs I'm weaving I could take this crap from seeing to believing Got a taste for blood and my tongue keeps bleeding From the words I spit, so sharp, so freezing So go behold, frostbite they feeling I could tear you apart or I could go heal them Don't believe in faith, don't believe in ceilings I just need a taste and my mind starts peeling I don't pace myself, I grind on kneeling Got lust for change, I just love the feeling uh. I ain't gonna give up Got too little time, I'ma live up Head down, 